crazy how like well known the sport is now as well. Like I walk down the street, there are these big ass ears that cauliflowers. Like, yeah, and everyone like I get stopped in the most random places. Like, bro, are you a fighter? Are you a fighter? And everyone thinks it's the coolest shit ever. Yeah. <laughs> like before, I walk down the street with this, I'll be like, oh my god, he's disfigured. <laughs> like poor thing, Donny, don't look. I'm telling their kids, I'm like. <laughs> What is it from? Like, is it a lot of head clashing into your ear? There are like three wrestling practices I had this. Are you serious? Yeah. I went to, uh, I had this guy in a front headlock. I snapped his head down, went to reshoot, and um, he popped his head up right into my ear. And it just started to swell after that. It's, wow. Uh, yeah. And then, like, I went to roll the next day. Like, I had it drained and everything, but I went to roll the next day, and some guy, like, smacked my ear, and it just popped open again. I went to the doctor. He, like, cut it open and it exploded crazy yeah it was crazy man because i was sitting there um he numbed it all up and he stabbed it and i saw he was wearing a face shield and i see like blood squirt on his face shield, oh. but i couldn't feel anything oh so what? i see like little pieces of bah, like blood and uh scar <laughs> tissue just pop open i'm like oh my god good thing he's wearing a face mask yeah it was worse because i had school the next day so he like packed it and he wrapped my head up with things i'm like <laughs> Try to wear a hat, try to wear like a hood. <laughs> oh, like, how the shoot. fuck am I gonna explain this? 